News of the abuse has taken social media like wildfire, with many questioning why. Our newsroom has learned that the Grenada National Coalition on the Rights of the Child, the Child Protection Agency and other relevant persons were also alerted about this development. Social justice advocate Nandi Trotman Joseph, in referencing a report conducted by the St. George's University, which shows that more boys are now being sexually molested and abused than girls. We are all telling the girls, be careful, don't walk there, don't do this. And we just assume that our boy children are just going to make out just fine. This particular case is a timely reminder, the report of such a case is a timely reminder that all of our children, male and female, are vulnerable to predators. And therefore, the advice that we give to our girl children um, about touching and uh, inappropriate touching and, you know, not accepting gifts from strangers running away, not going into vehicles alone with adults, those same kinds of advice should also be shared with our boy children. She says the report also points to the fact that a pedophile has no sexual preference, hence these occurrences. Trotman Joseph, who is also an attorney at law, says if the accusations are founded, the man in question could face a number of charges. The prosecution would have to look at the, all of the circumstances, the facts, and the available evidence. So, for example, the first one might be kidnapping. It might There may be a charge of false imprisonment. There may be a charge of sexual grooming. For example, if the child was forced to look at pornography and so on. There may be a charge of unnatural connection as it was referred to in our criminal code. Um, if there was actual um, penetration of that child, that has one connotation within the meaning of the law. If that cannot be proved by DNA evidence and other evidence, well then you may have a situation of sexual assault. Many say this incident and other recent incidents gives a clarion call for constitution reform, which has encapsulated enhanced protection laws for children's rights and stiffer penalties for offenses. Eugenia Peters, GBN News.